DNA taken from cats has been used for the first time in the UK in a criminal investigation to convict a man of killing and dismembering his friend. Scientists from the University of Leicester were called in by detectives investigating the discovery of a man's body found on a beach. Stacey Foster reports. Scientists at Leicester University have been at the forefront of the use of DNA fingerprinting ever since it was pioneered by Sir Alec Jeffries in the 1980s. Since then, it's been used to convict and clear thousands of people accused of murder. But now, for the first time in the UK, DNA taken from cats has been used by the scientists to help convict a man accused of killing his friend. The dismembered body of David Guy was found on a beach in South Sea in Hampshire in July last year. He was wrapped in a curtain covered in cat hairs. Identical hairs were found in a flat belonging to David Hilda. He was cleared of Mr Guy's murder but convicted of manslaughter. Cat hairs uh, are a bit problematic because they're basically very tiny. There's very little DNA within them, so you have to be exceedingly careful in how you do it, and it has to be done in a very clean environment. Because there's so little DNA, you're forced to go down uh, the route of using a, a very sensitive technique called mitochondrial DNA, and that's the sort of database that we had to make. Scientists at the university plan to publish and expand their cat DNA database so it can be used in future crime investigations. They say the country's 10 million cats are unwittingly tagging clothes and fabric in homes across the UK. And they believe it could be a real boost for forensic science and may help the police to solve undetected crimes. Stacey Foster, ITV News.